Hi guys, we're on lesson two today. We just um, learned our we just learned why connections are important, and Mrs. Seymour is going to remind you of some of our words this week by taking a tour around my house and finding some things that match our words. Okay, our words for this week though. Let's look at them really quick. Okay, bustle, channel, connect. Empire, mention, peak, scholar, settle, vehicle, and zigzag. So, I'm going to bonk my head on that light. We're going to find some of these things after I erase this too from my face. If my house is a mess, I'm sorry. Um, we're going to find some of these things so that we remember what these words mean. The first thing that I think is actually kind of easy to remember is the word channel. And how am I going to remember the word channel? There's a few definitions. One of the definitions is that it's a bed or path that a river can flow through. One of them is, is it's a groove or cut that allows water to pass through it. One of them is it's a body of water that joins together into two, it's a body of water joining two larger bodies of water. So two larger bodies of water comes in and it joins one large body of water. And then the next one is a channel is a way to carry an electrical message to the TV. That's what I wanted to show you. Channel changer. This will remind you that the word channel, there's lots of definitions, but there's also when we change the channel on the TV, the channel is the station that carries the electrical message to my TV. Okay? So... That was the one I wanted to remind you about, channel. Now, the next one I wanted to remind you about was vehicle. We're going to go take a look at Mrs. Seymour's vehicle. It's bright out here. What's my vehicle that I drive, I wonder? It's a Honda Element. That's my vehicle. Vehicle is a moving object. What does it say about vehicle? I'll find my. That's my vehicle, that green Honda element. A vehicle is anything on wheels or that people use to take something from one place to another. So that's my vehicle. It's my car and I use it to get from one place to another. A little, a little um, field trip of a couple of things around my house. Did I mention? There's another thing. Did I mention that that I live in Southern Utah? So mention is. I'm just giving it a quick little mention. I'm not giving you more details. I'm just mentioning that I live in Southern Utah. Okay. And that's the only three I wanted to show you today to remind you of. Channel, vehicle, and mention. Now, you have two assignments today on page 37. Not page 37. 38. Exercise two, you're going to see connections. You'll look at the group of words and decide which one. There are three that are related, one that's not. You're going to find the one that's not related. Okay? Then on the other one, you're going to apply their meanings. And again, it's only ten simple questions, five of each kind. Sorry, it's a little jumbly since I'm holding it. Our connection minute today, I already read it. I don't have to draw it out of the, the jar, is... Have you gone to a live class anytime today? I'm sure you've been watching some Daily Dose recordings and seeing lots of things, but have you gone to a live class? Look on your online school, your weekly plan, and you can see when a class is live, and you can click right on that link. It might say 9 o'clock is math or 9.30. I mean, 1 o'clock is writing or 2 o'clock is reading. Click on that and you can join a live class with kids all over the state going to be in your class and you have a live teacher there. So try to do a live class as well as watching these recordings. Thanks. Learn your words. Practice, practice. See ya. Bye.